We're down in Drum Point doing a uh, pretty long retaining wall at a driveway. Um, kind of at a good point in this job to kind of show y'all what we do with these walls, uh, how they're built, how we backfill and stuff like that. So take a little quick walk around here, kind of show you guys what we got going on. Um, so that's the perforated drain tile pipe that we're going to put behind the wall so it gets proper drainage. Um, and further down here, you kind of see. Oh. <laughs> uh -uh. This wall is about 100 foot long. Goes around this drive right here, and then we're going to put a box drain behind it so that when the water comes down, it's going to go into that drain. Could be pretty cool. Um, kind of help get water away from here. And you can kind of see here how each block is filled with gravel. So each course here coming up is all solid wall. And then what we do over here, each, every other course gets a row of geo grid that goes from inside the block this way and ties it into the backfill that we put behind it. And then here, we got it covered up now, but this has a, uh, this is a box drain, so that what's gonna happen is the water's gonna come off the driveway and then we're gonna direct it into this drain so that it goes around the wall rather than holding water pressure behind it. So. Now see here. This section here is almost finished, so we got three courses, then a capstone to hide everything, keeps everything looking like a nice finished product. Um, and then in this case, we're gonna put, we're gonna backfill with like a uh, asphalt millings and then tie it all right into the existing asphalt driveway. So it's gonna look sharp when it's done. 